hey if you want to send someone a DWG files let's say a bunch of sheets and you want to rename them so only the sheet number and sheet name is visible first you have to export the sheets uh, select all the sheets in the model and include all of them and you don't want to export views on sheets as a references so you can leave the project name hit OK and uh, Revit exports the DWG files so now go to the folder and you can see there's a bunch of PCP files that you don't want. Next right click on the Windows Start and choose Windows PowerShell Admin. So here's your Windows PowerShell. Next copy the address where your DWG files are located. In the Windows PowerShell enter cd change directory to apostrophes and paste the copied address. Now you're in the directory where the DWGs are located. Now you can pause the video and copy the script that I pasted in, or you can copy it from the description of this video. Press enter and enjoy. All of your DWG files are renamed in under a second. Now as a bonus tip, let's say you want to add a today's date to all of those DWGs because you made them today. In the PowerShell press up and you get the last script that you entered. Now edit the script as I do. Enter today's date. And remember to enter DWG extension on the end. Press enter and you have all of your DWG files renamed with today's date. And let's say you want to change today's date to tomorrow's date if you update the DWG files. Edit the script as I do. And first you have a part of the file name you want to select. And then after the comma you have a part of the file name you want to rename. Just be careful and remember that there is no undo button in the Windows Explorer after you use PowerShell to rename files. Basically you can use this script to rename all kinds of files, PDFs, JPEGs. You have to replace the DWG extension with the PDF extension. And I hope this was a helpful tip. Have a great day and see you in the next video.